We study the biology of aging and aim to understand the molecular mechanisms underlying the reduced regeneration and renewal of old tissues. Renewal and regeneration are the task of stem cells in every tissue, but something goes wrong with the stem cells during aging process. Uh, they get exhausted and cannot maintain tissues. We try to understand why. So with the ERC, uh, the, the fact that you are recognized as an independent thinker with novel ideas uh, gives some self-confidence into your next projects. And this is maybe one of the most uh, influential parts of the ERC funding for the future beyond the actual ERC project. The aging population poses a major healthcare challenge. And we hope that by understanding the basics of aging on a cellular level, we can find new ways to, for example, battle the loss of muscle function and muscle decline in elderly patients. This would give many years for patients at home, uh, independent of any services and, and uh, increase their quality of life. For me, being a researcher is really the one thing that I want to do. The possibility of everyday discovery and seeing something that nobody has ever seen before, knowing that this possibly is something that nobody even thought of before, uh, is, is very tantalizing. Uh, it is also uh, catchy, uh, but of course, in the eventual success, if they come, it's also extremely rewarding. The ultimate goal of our project is to really understand the loss of regeneration during aging. This will open ways to treat multiple diseases, starting from problems with chemotherapy, how do you recover from, from toxic treatments, how uh, old people can maybe recover faster from uh, multiple uh, health problems that they encounter. And of course, there is the the moonshot of actually touching on the aging process itself and allowing a better life towards the latter years of one's life. Currently we think that human beings can live for about 120 years and you get to the 120 years by eating very little, having the perfect set of genes and just being overall lucky. But uh, there's no reason why biology wouldn't go further. There's already many examples in the nature of, of basically immortal animals. So the fact is that uh, the better care you take of your stem cells, the longer you will live.